In this video, I'll be showing you how to transfer USDT from BitGet over to Trust Wallet. This is a very quick and simple thing to do, so make sure you watch this video all the way to the end so you don't miss any important steps. So in order to transfer USDT from BitGet over to Trust Wallet, we must first have a BitGet account and a Trust Wallet account set up and ready. So make sure you have those ready before we get started. When you have got those ready, you want to first head over to BitGet and log into your account. And once you've done that, you can go up to the top right corner and look for this wallet icon and then go down to Assets Overview. From there, we're going to go ahead and click on Spot, and this will show us all of the crypto that's in our BitGet wallet. So I'm assuming that you've already got USDT in your BitGet account, and if that is the case, you can come down to where it says USDT, and we're going to go over to the right-hand side and choose to withdraw. And when we reach this page, we can head over to our Trust Wallet. So when you're in your Trust Wallet, it will look something like this, and since we're trying to send USDT into our Trust Wallet, we're going to choose to Receive up here. Now from here, we have to look for USDT, so you can either scroll through and find it, or you can simply type it in at the top. So if you search for it and you can't find it, that probably means that you haven't yet imported it. So if you can't actually see it, you're gonna have to go back, then go up to this search bar at the top, and now search for it. And from there, we can choose the USDT on whatever network we want. Now for this video, I'm just gonna be sending it via Ethereum, but you can choose whichever network you want, as long as you are able to withdraw it from BitGet on that network. So if I was sending my USDT on the Ethereum network, I can click this one here because this is Tether USD on Ethereum. So I can toggle this and now we can go back to that screen we were on a second ago, choose to receive, and now we can see the ERC20 USDT. So we now get given a wallet address and we can simply copy this and now go over to BitGet again. So as I said earlier, you do want to make sure you send it on the same network, otherwise your funds will be lost. And right now it's set to TRX, which is wrong in my case because I'm choosing to send it via Ethereum. So I'm going to have to choose this one, ETH ERC20, and I can click on that. From there, I can paste in the address that it just gave me. And when you're happy that everything's correct, you can go ahead and click Next. Now you will have to set up two-factor authenticator before you're allowed to send from BitGet. So if you haven't yet done that, do that first. And from there, you'll be able to choose the amount of USDT that you want to send over. And once you've confirmed that all the details are correct and you're happy with everything, you can go ahead and choose to send. Now each network will take a different amount of time to send over. And as you can see, ETH says estimated time 5 minutes. So once you have actually sent it, you will then see that appear in your wallet after around 5 minutes or however long it tells you it's going to be. So that's how you can transfer USDT from BitGet to Trust Wallet. I hope you found this video helpful and thanks for watching.